Did you know that in addition to playing video games on Twitch and YouTube that I'm also a published author? My debut novel, Transhuman Evolution, is available at your favorite online retailer. Check it out. Subscribe to the channel. Now back to the game. Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here, we're back with Fallout 76 and uh, and we're gonna, we're gonna jump into it. Um, this is our third stream here on Fallout 76, of course. And yeah, I don't know. Um, I'm still still making videos for the YouTube channel, of course, and I keep saying, of course, of course, of course. Um, Red Rocket City of Seal. Right. Uh, continue. Let's play. Uh, yeah. Here we go. So yeah, so I'm still, you know, I'm still covering indie games over on my YouTube channel, and I might, I may bring those over here. Um, my first foray into covering indie games over here on Twitch didn't work out as well because if the game's not good or if it's sort of tired or, you know, you end up with, I end up not wanting to keep playing them, you know, a half hour is a good amount of time for like a mediocre or bad uh, indie game, but it's not, half hour is not a super good length for a Twitch stream. Um, at least not according to Twitch itself. Twitch says two hours is about the right amount for a Twitch stream. So I guess that's what we're going to aim for with these Fallout 76 things. Now, the nice thing about Fallout 76 is it seems like it's uh, very large and endless, and it shouldn't be hard to do two-hour streams. Um, the other game I might do is I recently picked up Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, what is... Disable radio by hunting down and defeating enemy code carriers. I'm, I'm probably not going to do that. I'm not going to do any of that daily stuff. Um... I mentioned this to a friend often if a game has dailies if there are dailies to do in a game i will stop playing it and that's happened to me a bunch of times um i'll, I'll be i'll be really enjoying a game um and then the game's like oh by the way you can earn these extra rewards by doing these daily quests and i'm like oh uh okay and then i do them a couple times and then I'm like, oh, right, so I'm done playing now. Um, and then I am just done playing. I stop playing once uh, once I've done the dailies. Uh, oh, claim workshop at Tyler Hunter, uh, Tyler County Dirt Track. Okay, I, I did that last time. I mean, we already did that, but it did give some resources. I don't know. I don't know. Do we do we care about resources at the moment? How much? How much are we carrying? Uh, items. Uh, we could we could use some resources. We could also use some leveling. Um, yeah, I mean, let's go intelligence again. Why not? Stim packs, pipe weapons, break, right away. Gain plus one hacking skill. It says I have max rank. I don't know. Well... Right. So I took, I took a perk I should not have taken, right? Because I already had the maximum thing. So I don't know what that does. Two perk coins, sure. How do we? We don't get we don't get legendary, per, legendary perks, do we? Requires a f level fifty character. Okay, so we're not, we're not anywhere near that. That's fine. All right. Well, let's go get some more ingredients or whatever it is. Because that's what happened last time. And then it was like, defend the outpost. And then I got some XP, but... Yeah, I don't... I don't plan on... I need 25 caps. Okay, never mind. Because uh, I'm remembering correctly, I'm very poor at the moment. And that's... It's okay. We don't need to be rich. We can be smart. So is this the right... This is the right way, isn't it? What is that? Oh, that's someone's camp. Cool. All right, so we're headed this way, down the road, just trolloping down the road. Dun 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 dun. Might as well follow the road. There might be some interesting stuff along the way to find, like these plants, which is very nice. And yeah. Oh, I heard some gunshots. What's going on? 
some fighting going on somewhere. What, what is that? I mean, are those friendlies fighting or not friendlies? Or? And what were they what were they doing? Who were they fighting? Now that people have come back to this area, they'll all want to be setting up places like Foundation. Okay. So we'll just steal your potatoes that you've gone. So they're building they're building up their farm. Okay. I follow. I don't know who they were fighting, but they were uh, oh, they're fighting this protectron. Okay. That's the thing that happens. Let's keep going, though. We're making our way downtown. Walking fast. Faces passing. I'm homebound. Rhododendron flower added. Nice. So we're going up, and we're going to try and talk to this leader. Um, but I don't have any stats other than intelligence. It's the only thing I've got going for me. So probably what I'm going to end up having to do is kill this leader. But that's okay. We're allowed to do that. What is this? Uh. Uh, okay. I don't. Is this part of a quest or. Are we just playing on like weird VCR mode? That's. That's odd. And will this, will this stop? Okay. Uh, that's really weird. Right, and once I sniffed it, it stopped. So we've had the experience. I don't know why that's there. Weird. Cool. Well, we're, um, making our way slowly towards the, uh, bandit encampment. Where we either have to talk to talk him out of doing stuff, which we don't probably have the charisma for. What are, what are we nearby? So we gotta. Okay, so he's there on the left. So what's all that? That's mushrooms. Mm. All right. So these are scavengers. Are they friendly though? Where should we go? Uh, crater's the right choice. Um, that's what I said, but she refuses to go. Okay. <laughs> I knew that was the right decision. We'll head there now. Okay, so I solved the problem, I guess. There's some fish. I do like the fish. The fish are cool. Mm, what have we got in here? Nothing. Just a tent. I do like the tent, though. Alright, let's head up here. Back on the road. Gotta convince the gang leader to leave Wayward alone. We know the, we know the passcode. Um... And we've got this pistol, which is fine. The pistol is fine. I like his setup. He's got some castles and stuff going on. Oh, that's bad. Got him. All right. Okay. Gotta love the lag on the uh, damage showing up. All right. So we dealt with the stupid super mutants. And we got a few extra caps. Okay.
Alright, well... I guess we go around the side. We try and go... I think we try and talk our way in. We know the... We know the password and everything, so... Yeah, rather than trying to break in and sneak in. We do have the stealth boy as well, if we need to assassinate the guy. But we may as well, uh... We may as well try and talk to him first. We'll see. We'll see if that works. Uh, hello. Yeah. Um, I'm here to talk to your boss. Oh, yeah? What's the password? Uh, yeah, it was Blue Danube. Yep. Go on through. Thanks, man. I will. Okay. So how many dudes are here? That guy's just jamming on some drums. Hey, Gem Pop. I smell Okay. So let's go have a chat with the student, find out what he's really like. Jacobs. His name is Jacobs. I wanted his name to be Jacob, but it's Jacobs. It's fine. It is what it is. Alright. Where about... Where's our, where's our man? And we'll take all his pool balls, because that's a super friendly thing to do. Absolutely. What's going on here? Brewing station. Okay. Uh, what is that? Short pump action shotgun. Yeah, well, we'll have that. Have all this garbage and stuff. Who knows what what it will turn into. I'm sure it's going to weigh us down and we'll end up having to get rid of it, but hopefully there's a... Can we... No, we can only craft there. Yeah. Because we're an intelligence build, right, we might as well lean into it. What is this guy doing? So he's here in case I... I mean... I am going to take all your stuff, though. Thanks, man. Thanks for the tip. What else have we got in here? Ooh, a blood pack. We'll take that. Have that metal chess piece. Oh, some drugs. Love it. Oh, we're over we're overburdened, of course. Let's see. Metal chess piece gives us uh Man, look at this not appropriate level. Most of us were holed up but it's heavy. Easy to forget what outside's like. Mm. Junk, there we go. Some of the stuff is gonna be heavy. Alright, how do we drop? Drop. Mm. Those mutant things that were here before thought they were tough stuff. It's almost kind of sad. Coffee cups are half a kg. That's a lot, man. Someone else. How about you leave me alone? Beer bottles are also half a kg. Alright. I mean, that should take us back underweight, but that is a lot. Boss is inside, so feel free to get out of my face. I mean, I'm just standing here, man. Calm down. Gen Pop? Uh, no? Okay, so we've gotten rid of... Oops. We've gotten rid of most of the stuff. We're watching. I mean, did, we did drop most of the stuff, didn't we? Yeah. I won't do anything stupid. Oh, here we go. Scrap items. Ugh, why didn't I just do... I didn't see this here. My bad. Alright, and... Let's uh, scrap, scrap. I mean, we should sell some of the stuff, right? Oh, fashionable glasses are worth quite a bit. Why are how are hard hats lighter than a coffee cup? I I just don't know, man. Yeah, that's heavy. 
Short hunting rifle. Yep. I mean, that does a lot of damage. We'll get rid of that. Okay. So... What can we craft? Can we craft anything is the question. Oh, this is an ammo place? We actually don't need to craft anything. Yeah, let's exit. Alright, so that should lower our... Yeah. Now we're now we're doing well. Now we're cooking with gas. Volatile materials box. I mean, may, we may as well take all their stuff, right, while we're up here? Oh, a laser rifle. I will definitely have that, thank you. Since we're allowed to be here. I guess this is supposed to be loot if we come in guns blazing. Um, but we're not guns blazing. We're being friendly. Well, friendly-ish. Taking everything that they have. For trouble? You're about uh, to fight. I'm, I'm not looking for trouble, I promise. Yay! There we go. Alright. So they're unhappy with me being here. And there are quite a few of them. That makes sense. Let's go inside. This was the direction to go, right? Or did we just leave the building? Oh, who knows what I'm doing. I never know. Life is a mystery. See, in, uh, the disadvantage of Twitch, of course, is that we have to sit through all this. On YouTube, I would fast forward. Well, this is where I just came. This is where... What? Okay. Wrong way. Let's go back inside. Alright. Alright, so we were already in here. I just... I went to the wrong door. How are you looking at? Uh... The hell am I looking at? Where, where is he? Oh, downstairs. Okay, we didn't go. We didn't make it downstairs. Ooh, there's like a cave and a tunnel and stuff. But we're gonna, we're gonna. Hopefully, they don't catch me doing this because I think they would get angry about this. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. You didn't see me robbing you, so you can't get angry about it. That's the rules. Alright. I might go back upstairs and, uh, and scrap all this stuff, and then we'll come back down, because we're... I mean, that's... Basically, so far, the game has been all about, you know... Finding stuff and scrapping it. Alright, let's go upstairs. Here we go. Don't do anything stupid. Yeah, they don't like me at all. Watching. Yep, that worked. Cooking oil. Uh, scrap. Scrap the lead pipe, of course. Oh, I unlocked some. I unlocked some more stuff, so that's good. Um, oop. We'll scrap this. Tweaked automatic receiver. Love it. For now. Alright, so now we're headed down into this. Suspect he finally managed to get himself killed. That was a long shot anyway. I always figured it'd take someone coloring with a full box of crayons to find us our prize. Okay. So we found we found the bad dude. And by bad dude I mean he's just So who's Jackie? What? What? Ooh, it's a weapons workbench. What's up, man? You the one with the password? Yeah. I presume someone gave it to you because they thought you could be useful. Name's Roper. Now, explain to me why the hell you're taking up my air. Uh... Is that so? 
Yes. And why exactly would I do that? Because uh, I'm Crane and I know where the treasure is. <laughs> sure you are. But if you know where your treasure is, well, then I'm all ears. <laughs> I love that. Um, you know, maybe the real treasure's been here all along. Friendship. Uh. <laughs> Barrel of laughs, aren't you? I am. I'm very funny. Are you going to tell me where this thing is? Or are you just wasting my time? I am just kind of wasting your time here. Damn right you will. But I'm a generous man. You bring me the location first, you'll get your fair share. Now get out. My people shouldn't bother you while you're doing this for us. So long as you don't bother them. Uh, okay. Cool, so I had a conversation with that guy. He seems a little bit evil. Let's, um... Let's see if we can craft a weapon. Cause we've got a we've got a workbench here. We might as well. Um, pipe guns, um, pipe revolver. So we can't actually make very much. Let's repair stuff. What? I want to basic repair kit. No, I just want to repair it. Okay, how do we... How do we... We must be able to do this. Space, modify, repair. Um, repair... Workbench repair. There we go. Alright, so now let's... Um, Send a receiver, stub barrel. Oh, true stock. What is it? It's true. Mm. Standard sight, so we can give it glow sights. That's cool. Glow sights makes it worth less. That's weird. Glow reflex sight. Let's go with that one. Nice. No muzzle. Can't do anything else to it. All right. And what about our laser, uh, our short pump action shotgun? It's got a standard barrel, so we can make it a long barrel, which gives it more range. I'm going to give it a medium barrel. Let's give it a long barrel. There we go. Standard sights, standard grip, no muzzle, default appearance. All right. So that's all we can do for our shotgun. Let's have a look at our... Oh, so we can do stuff here, but we don't have enough stuff. All right, that's fine. Mm. Oh. I wanted to repair the, the laser rifle. Oh, I don't have... I don't have the stuff to repair it. That makes sense. I'm with it. Let's... Might as well, may as well repair our stuff. All right. So he said he won't. His guys won't attack me, and um, that's all good. I mean, I did rob his house, so I guess, I guess we're even. Like, I mean, I like literally broke into his safe and stole all of his stuff out of it. So, yeah. That's that's the kind of thing that's that's the same as even, isn't it? Where are we off to now? Oh, we're gonna we're gonna see what the key unlocks because that was nearby, I think. We'll do that before we head back to talk to Duchess. So I am excited. Man, the loading times were pretty long today, especially coming out of this building. Yeah. And now it's daytime, apparently. It was sort of nighttime before, wasn't it? Alright, so now we want to go... What's that? Alright, so we want to go find out what this key unlocks. 
So we're going to do that. Nice. Alright, so we're going to go east. Uh, we got to find our way out of here first, I suppose. I mean, they've built up quite the uh, fortification, so... Have that. Right. Yep, so now we head east to go find out what the key unlocks. We probably also need to look at Morgantown Airport at some point. Man, our action points are really low. And in this game, that means that uh, my stamina is really low. Right, we want some food. Food and drink. What is mountain honey? Sure, let's have some of that. Drinking mountain honey made noises in my head. That's cool. Love it. And we'll have some purified water as well. Oh, hey, the doing that like increased our action points. That's pretty cool. So we are just setting out cross country. My gut feeling is that, based on previous Fallout games, setting out cross-country is a pretty good way to ensure that we get killed by a Deathclaw or something. It is very pretty, though. I'll give it that. I found a pretty lookout here. Nice. Sometimes it's worth, you know, stopping to just have a look at everything. So what is that? Oh, that's have a investigate Morgantown Airport. Okay. Who's this guy and what's he doing? It's just about time to eat. How's it going today? Finally, a clear day. Maybe I can get something done now. Um You got that right. Oh, feels great today. Okay. Just a nice little conversation with that guy. And now what we uh see if he doesn't notice us breaking into his camp. Right. Sunny makes a good hoagie. Oh, I'll take another shot. Oh, he's hitting golf golf balls off. I love that. That's very cool. It's very pretty up here, man. It is very pretty. So he's not he's not wrong about this being a nice day. I like that it's here, you know? Like I said, it makes the um Makes the game feel more alive, for sure. Who's this? I'm trying to find the right place to settle down. Okay. Good luck with that, man. We will continue walking this way. We're gonna find out what this key opens. I'm excited. I'm very excited. Hmm. Okay. There's a little spot. Oh, it's like a hatch. Okay. Well, let's go in here and see what's in here first. Discovered Vault 51. Huh. That's pretty excellent. 
We found our first vault. Quest started home expansion. Okay. Speak to the claim center robot. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, let's um, scrap some stuff. Oh, a visitor. Oh, I thought this day would never come. I haven't <laughs> a visitor in ages. Welcome to the Appalachian Shelters Claim Center, visitor. I'm called Mr. Clark. It's my job to help eager new customers such as yourself take your first step into the miraculous world of shelters. Oh, cursory analysis suggests you are likely here to... <laughs> Goodness, forgive my tone. I'm experiencing some memory issues. <clears throat> As I was saying, a bright-eyed visitor like yourself must be here to claim your free shelter today. Is that right? Uh, yes. Splendid. Oh, before I can distribute your shelter to you, you'll need to register as a shelter owner. The terminal in the back will guide you through it. Once you've finished registering, return to me, and I'll distribute your free shelter to you. Uh, okay. Terminal Helen. Right? So there's a bunch of garbage here. Yeah. Let's get in there and use it. Shelter's information hub. Oh, geez. There's a lot to read. For your camp, they come ready to be customized. They are a perfect sanctuary for industrious architects and those who want a little peace and quiet from the dangers of Appalachia. Oh, uh, all right. So I'm guessing... This is like a home or whatever. This is this is the MMO, you know, it's the home. Um right, shelter entrances. You can be used to access your new home. Each shelter you own comes with an entrance. You can place multiple entrances to any of your shelters. Right. Dweller on dweller violence. And then return to Appalachia, you will retain your hostile status. The reverse is also true. Your belongings will be returned to you. All right. All right. So. Register new owner. Nice. Okay, yeah, I did that. Let's look at Ruben's notes. This is what we came here for. Um, and I'm already back at its front door. It gives me the creeps knowing it's right there, but if I'm going to get back in it, it'll pay off to have a base this close. Joke's on me, I guess it's some kind of dumb real estate project with the world's most annoying marketing bot running it. Just my luck to get stuck with another stupid robot. <laughs> yep, turns out the 51's network protected with a crazy firewall. Why is it, what is he doing? Oh my, I've been unsuccessful so far. Right. I'm, I'm reading it pretty quickly. I can read faster than I can talk. Right. And last entry. The speech patterns keep changing too. I thought it was just this hard word starting to go, but then he called me Mr. Candidate instead of Mr. Gill. <laughs> All right. Communications logs. Oh. Human activity on the network. Can you hear me now? Right. We're just we're just reading some stuff. Okay. Anyone out there? Alright, and the sales pitch. 
Marketing likes shelters, the home of the future. <laughs> cool. Alright. So I think that's everything. So now we can go talk to the guy. It looks like you've successfully registered as a shelter owner. Congratulations, visitor. A Thanks, man. Marvelous new world of home expansion awaits. I'll distribute your free shelter to you, along with some materials to build your shelter's entrance. As a personal thank you for being my customer. Before Thanks, man. Part ways, visitor. Is there anything else I can help you with? Uh. Then allow me to extend a warm shelter's claim center farewell to you, along with my thanks for being my first customer. Enjoy your new home, visitor. Okay. So, we, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. So we went to the place and we got some stuff. We got a shelter or something. Right. Indeed. All right. Well, let's just scrap some stuff. And what? We can, um, we can modify and repair our armor and stuff. Which we will do. Yeah, let's change it to boiled leather. There we go. Um... There we go. We are improving. Boiled leather. Nice. Make it a little bit harder for them to kill me. There's a lot of different music going on, isn't there? Okay. So we need to... Oh, we don't have any more leather. Alright. Well, it needs repairing. But that's okay. I guess we'll just leave it for now. We will just leave it. And we'll head back out. So we solved the mystery of what the key opens. The key opens uh, player homes, I think. Yo, hey! Uh, not Edge. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, man. We're just playing some Fallout 76. We're trying to. I just got my player home, and uh, yeah, we're we're into it. I think that the next thing we're going to go do is... Man, we're all the way up there. I think we're going to fast travel back down and talk to... Um, talk to what's-her-name. Oh, where do, where do we go? There we are. Can we fast forward? Uh, can we fast travel? Yes, we can. Oh, six caps. That's fine. Yeah, so I'm actually uh, quite enjoying Fallout 76. Yeah, when I first played it, it was very lifeless. Extremely. Um, but yeah, there's lots of stuff going on. We're going to go talk to the Duchess now. And... Uh, and see what happens. We've agreed to help her find the treasure. Whatever that is. Well, we agreed to, to help that other guy find the treasure. Oh. Oh, that was my... That's all my home expansion stuff that I just picked up. Alright. You're back. I am back. You managed to get those punks out of our hair yet? I did not. <laughs> oh, is that all? That is all. I guess I should have specified how I would have liked this to be resolved. I suppose it's on both our heads to find this treasure then. It is. Let's do it. But you did good. Shows maybe you could be trusted. Maybe. But there's still the issue of my missing muscle. 
They went out chasing some unsavory characters. Never came back. Oh yeah. Two of the tougher cookies I've met in my day. So them being gone this long means something happened. You track them down? Maybe I remember a thing or two about this crane fella. Sounds good. Let's do it. Um. Well, missing person number one's named Polly. Got a transmitter in her. You could track her with your little radio there. Missing person number two goes by Saul. Those two are closer than toes and bad stilettos. So if you find one, the other's likely close by. Find them for me, and I'll pay you for the privilege of getting to yell at them in person. <laughs> uh, all right. Not the foggiest, but that's where the transmitter comes in. Tune to her station, and it should get you going in the right direction. Sure. Um. They're called the Scorched. They're an unpleasant bunch. Yeah, I've run into them. They've got raw skin with crystals sticking out of them. And they're still real handy when it comes to firearms and bludgeons. So you'll want to be careful around them. That's for damn sure. Okie dokie. I mean, that's, uh, I do like the voice acting. Uh, I'll find out what happened. Appreciate it. Polly's tracking frequency is 99.7. The once proud home of Appalachia's smooth jazz. I figured someone should get some use out of it. Find out what happened to him. If I need to find new people, I'd like to at least ensure I tried to do right by the old ones. Alrighty. Is that it? Are we done? We are done. Ooh, let's, let's sell some stuff though first. Um, because I do have a bunch of random stuff that I don't want to be carrying around. Um, oh, that's only worth three. Wow, my... The difference between what uh, it says things are worth, I think it's my charisma is just very, very low. Um, but I do need some more caps, man. I just, yeah. We'll sell that as well. Because it's heavy. See, this when I was looking at this in my own inventory, it was saying it was worth like 25 or something. It's not. Which is why I wasn't selling stuff before. That is so much food. And it's like, is it worth selling all this? Uh, yeah, we'll sell those. Um, what else is worth stuff? Sweet roll? Sure. Yeah. Let's go. I'm done selling stuff. So, as part of my reward... <laughs> Right? Not sure what the frog's doing, but, uh, I like it. I like it. Oh, what did I get? I got a level. Oh, that's cool. It's time to level up. I would love to open my unopened perk pack. Nice! Um... Peanut asks a grape out on date. Grape says you're nuts. Okay. Classic. Uh, yeah, let's just keep on going with the intelligence. We probably weapons break 20% slower. Yeah, let's upgrade that bad boy. Right, so do we have a... We've got a per perception one now. That's good. Um, can't. All right. So how do we... So we can rank some of them up. I'm still figuring this... I'm still figuring this out because it is very different to other Fallout games. All right, so we've got to, oh, we got to turn into the radio station. That was the that was the next thing to do. All right. Oh. 
so we, we need to go on the map. Where are we off to is the question. Where is... Tune your pit-boy to track the guards. Oh, do I need to keep it tuned to that? Is that... Oh, let's claim the workshop. Where's that one? Let's go there. All right, so we got to keep it. We got to keep it tuned in. We can do that. Aha! All right, so we are going in the right direction. So that's that circle there. That's what we need to be doing. We are on our way. Yeah, this seems to be a reasonably safe area. Because I think this is, yeah, this is the newbie tutorial area. But that's fine. I am a newbie to Fallout 76, so that's what we're doing. Someone shooting. Oh, we found them. Or oh, we found some cor uh, scorched corpses. Okay. Right. Okay, so... So what just, what just unlocked? Search Molly mine. Okay, so we're going to the mine. We're about to go fight some Scorched in a mine. That's the plan. We can definitely do this. We will have no problems doing this. Strength in numbers. Quest started. What is... Oh, I mean, I. that's what I was already doing, right? I heard someone talking. But I guess it was just the the wind. Alright. So it was just this chick chilling. That's pretty gross. Let's get in there though. Let's get in there and do some fighting. We are a hardcore level 8 character going into the mine. Alright, search the mine for the people. There we go. I'm quite good at that minigame. I've done it a lot. It's the same mini game from uh, oh higher picklock skill. Oh right, because uh, and oh, what would that be under agility? I actually don't know. Yeah, I don't. I don't know what that would be. Oh, there's a note. You're in charge while I'm gone. Congratulations. And no, this doesn't mean they're paying you more. It looks good on a resume though. Uh, supply cage is locked up. Code is on the bulletin board. Double check everything before you close up. Oh, I mean, we might as well take it, right? Man, they're just, uh, really laying it on thick here. What's this? Oops, I missed him. And they, they do not notice. How did I miss him that many times? Like... Yeah. I'll just go center mass from now on because uh, not going center mass seems bad. Like the bullets are slow or something? Gotcha. 
Gotcha. Alright, we use a stim pack. So what is this? How do we... Mine... Okay, so we did that. So we got some, we got some coal for whatever good that's gonna do us. Alright. There was definitely another one down here, so... Alright, got, got that one in his stupid head. There we go. This is how we do it. Oh, what the hell? Okay, so I'm over encumbered again. Um, I wish there was a way to organize stuff by how much it weighed. That would be really good. Um, pitchfork can get dropped. Do not need short hunting rifles. Right, what else have we got? Man, we re we probably need to up our uh, our strength because we keep running out of collect an audio holotype. Okay. Um, because we keep running out of weight, so. That might be the next area. Or the lockpicking stuff. I don't like not having access to stuff. Oh my god. Gotcha. Okay. Ooh, we'll have some of that pre-war money. Delicious. But I think we're over encumbered again. I think that's what we're that's what we're dealing with. Are those like brains? I mean, what is going on there? Okay. So it's just all of our random weapons that we're carrying around. How much does our shotgun weigh? Weighs quite a bit. Let's drop it. Um, sure. Alright. I don't like having to leave stuff behind, but it is what it is. Um, we do not need to be drinking dirty water. Not... Over here! Over where? Your people. Oh, hey, what's up, man? I didn't even see you there. Hey, 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 hey. Tell me you got a stim pack. Uh, I I'm do. Here. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Good to know there's still some heart out there. Yeah, it's so, uh, pretty fun. I'm actually enjoying it quite a bit compared to what it to save our tails. did at the start. Um, like when it first came out, it was just totally empty and there were no people and it was just audio logs but now there's like people in it and it actually feels like a fairly janky fallout game so i am enjoying it for sure um if you're sold then yes much as i appreciate it i'm not the one who needs helping right now see these uh, scorched things have been herring the bar me and my bot sis polly got the bright idea to track down their nest and clear them out right but a couple of them got the drop on us before Polly chased them off deeper into the mine. I heard some fighting, but then uh, nothing. I think she's hurt. Look, you've got to find Polly. I can't be the reason she... Look, just find her. Please. Sure, I can do that. Um... Paul is your bot sister. Yeah, tell me what that is. It's look, when you get Polly back, I'll walk you through every little detail of how I became best friends with the machine. But first, I need you to save her. 
You think you can do that for me? I probably can. Yeah. <sighs> thank you, thank you. No problem. Once you've got her, just bring her back to the wayward. I I'll be there. And tell her... Tell her I'm sorry I couldn't be the one to save her. Uh, I guess I can do that as well. So now we're headed yeah. deeper into the mine. Yeah, so the game is, um, I, I guess it depends on your definition of good, right? Because, look, the game is janky. The combat's fairly stodgy. Um, it's not, like, it's not an A-plus game. It's certainly not even the best, um, it's not even a terribly good Fallout game, but... Um, I've played the other Fallout games several times, so this is more Fallout content, and I do like Fallout. Oh. I didn't even realize I was dying. Right. Ooh, that was, uh, that was a close one. I did not realize that I was that close to death. I got, I got busy talking and not paying attention to what's going on. Okay. And that is how we handle that. How do you like dim apples? We don't need that pitchfork, they're really heavy. Uh, and we're back to being uh, overloaded, of course. What is down here? Oh. We got some gold. So there was gold down here. That's pretty cool. And we can just mine it without a pickaxe. That's also pretty cool, I suppose. Um, but we're overloaded again, so... It's these stupid short hunting rifles. We'll just... You know, we'll just drop them. We really need, uh... We need more strength. We ain't got not enough strength. What's that? That's oh, just the corpse. Make sure that we're reloaded for the next battle. Take some glowing fungus. Hey, hey, someone there? I could use a lift. <laughs> you happen to see a young man on your way through? Early twenties, rough around the edges. I did. Think about a bullet's worth of extra lead in him. <laughs> He's alive. Thank God. That's You're good welcome. To hear. So. What do you say you and I help each other out? You get me back to the wayward, and I'll help you bake to a crisp anything that bothers us on our way out the door. Sounds good. That's the ticket. Now, let's... <gasps> hear that? Sounds like those things have regrouped. How about we make them regret it? Uh, sure. Come on, darling. Let's make sure these things never bother the wayward again. Uh, where are they, though? So he's a gun? So long. Oh. Well, that's cool. Crispy now. Getting shot up a bit, though. Gotta get my stim pack going. Oh, this guy's coming around the side. So fierce, so yeah. flammable. I mean, they're already scorched, right? Still waiting. Oh, 
Right. This is a good gun. Very good gun. Instance progress checkpointed. Okay. So we got more coming or Lucky we had some stim packs, man, because uh both of those combats were a little bit harder than anticipated. But I did like it. Ooh. Lucky we came over here. I guess the point is that we didn't have to. And we've now explored a little bit and got rewarded for it. That, that is something nice that I am finding, is that the game is doing a pretty good job of uh, rewarding me for exploration. And we're over encumbered again, of course. Um, yeah, let's just head out into Appalachia. We had to leave a lot of guns behind, but that is the way the game rolls. It's fine. Terraria. I have played Terraria. Absolutely. Um, I played a substantial amount of Terraria, actually. Um, and, uh, and Minecraft, and uh, a bunch of other sort of survival-y, crafty games. Um, Kingdom uh, is pretty good. Not that it's the same as Terraria, but yeah. No, I've, uh, I've definitely done my... Done a substantial amount of hours in those sorts of games. But why am I... There we go. Terraria was one of those games that uh, I played for a while. I did pretty well. Um, I never got... Yeah, I was never, like, really good at it. Um, I get distracted easily, and so... Yeah. I mean, I played I played Minecraft for a long time, and then someone was like, uh, Terraria's like 2D Minecraft, so I played 2D Minecraft, and I was like, hey, this is 2D Minecraft, and I actually had a really good time with it. Um, yeah, really, really good stuff. Uh, my kids still play it, absolutely, and sometimes I play with them. I think the, the big one we've played recently has been uh, Satisfactory. What bosses have I killed? In Terraria? Oh, man. Um, it was a significant amount of time ago. Oops. Oh, what just happened? I'm on fire? Why am I on fire? Sorry, I got, I got busy wrapped up talking about Terraria. Oh, and now there's more rats as well. Jeez, that was all, that was all really bad. Yeah, I don't look it, but I am quite old. So I think, um, I think the last time that I played Terraria, like, actually seriously was, like, maybe five years ago? That, man, that, that's, yeah, I'm really old. <laughs> Is that the main game that you play? Uh, have a guess. <laughs> have a guess. I, I promise I won't be offended if you guess wrong. Nice. Twenty-eight. Oh, that's very complimentary. <laughs> Thanks, man. I'm uh, my my oldest child is actually at university now. He's eighteen, so I'm I'm quite old, man. Um, I'm in my forties. <laughs> you wouldn't you wouldn't believe it though. I've uh, I have young skin because I spend all my time inside playing video games. <laughs> Right? Yeah, that's what I get told all the time. People are like, there's no way. There's no way your kid's at um, university. But he is. 
Um, my second oldest is turning uh, 17 this year, and my youngest is turning 15, so. Right foot bones. Man, those hunting rifles are really heavy. Yeah, it, it's weird. I Like, I go to buy alcohol, and I'm in New Zealand, right? So the drinking age in New Zealand is 18. So you'd think I probably wouldn't have a hard time buying alcohol, right? Because all I have to do is look like I'm over 18. I get carded every time I go to buy alcohol. It's really annoying. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, cool, man. Yeah, I'm down here in Dunedin. Sunny Dunedin. What do you do up in Auckland? <laughs> yeah, Dunners, man. <laughs> Are you a student? Yeah, nice. Nice. Yeah, Dunedin is the best. Well, I love Dunedin. I, when I married a New Zealander, she was like, she bought it for me for three, and she's selling it for eighty-five. That's rip off. Um, she was like, I want to live in New Zealand, and I'm like. All good, let's live in New Zealand, but um, I want to choose where we live, and I picked Dunedin because I, I absolutely love the city. Um, and believe it or not, it's the weather. <laughs> People always look at me really weird when I say that, that, um, that I picked Dunedin for the weather. But it's true. I love rain. I love sort of... I love being able to wear a hoodie all the time. Um, and I hate mosquitoes. And we just don't have mosquitoes in Dunedin. It doesn't happen, so... It's uh, kind of a good deal for me. But I've spent some time in Auckland. I used to um, I used to work for a wine company, and I had to spend a lot of time up there um, selling wine up on the North Shore. Here we go. So what is the Duchess gonna have to say? All right, half the gang reunited. Just have to find our gal and we'll be all set. Back at long last. But where's our girl? Did you find Polly? I did. Oh, um. Oh God, Polly? Yeah. Whoa. You're not looking so great, darling. Duchess, I'm not feeling great. Friend, why, why don't you sit her down? Uh, how do I do that? Um, Jug should do the trick. <laughs> this is real snug. <laughs> That's not going to do at all. Oh, Polly. This is all my fault. Solomon, no. Don't you dare. This is not... Uh, Duchess, tell me you emptied this out. <laughs> Did I? You know, I'm 80%. Duchess, it's all right. I, I can fix this. There's a robotics shop over in Somersville that... Oh. Oh, oh. Solomon, you're I'm, going nowhere. I'm sensing another fetch quest for myself. Look, I can feel it I'm coming. I'm sorry to even ask, but is there any chance you might be able to help us out here? I, I can make it worth your while. Find <laughs> Polly this new body. I'll tell you everything I know about Crane and his treasure. 
Sure, Please why not? Say yes. Um <laughs> What are we doing here? Where can I find Polly New Body? Yeah. Solomon, you had a spot in mind? Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's this <laughs> so buggy. robotics dealer over in Somersville. Uh, Duncan and Duncan. The uh, the owners boarded it up, but it's possible to get back there if if you know where to push. Uh, all right. You are a lifesaver. Here, take this. It's a signal beacon. Just plant that on Polly's new frame, and we'll handle it from there. And here, you'll need this to get into the place. Just leave it unlocked so we can come and get the body later. And make sure it's pristine. No damage, no reprogramming. Factory defaults only. I don't want anything going wrong in the transfer. And at the risk of sounding like a broken record, thank you. We'll all owe you big after this. You're damn right. Okay, so... Was there a... Oh, I got another level. Nice. Was there a, a workshop in here? Uh, maybe I'll just go to my... Maybe I'll go to my camp. Because that's what we're supposed to be doing, is using our camp. Because that's the, uh, the way the game works. For the Great War... Hmm... Yeah, I've been continually impressed with the uh, with the way the game looks, and I guess that's what they focused on at the expense of the content at the at first, anyway. All right. So where's my where is my camp? I don't. I do not even remember. There's my camp there. Where's the place we're supposed to be going? Hmm. Oh, I think this is the overseer's camp, so we can just use that. That's fine. Scrap all that. Um. But, let's modify that snub nose and see, see what we can do to it, because... I reckon... Should be able to make it a bit better. Standard grip. Oh. Right, so that's it. So we've made it. We've made it not a snub nose anymore. Of course. <laughs> um. How do we? Oh, what was the thing? Hmm. Um. No, I thought it was Q. Now, I'm, now I've got to look. Uh, settings, controls, because I can't remember what it was. I need to toggle. No, workshop. I want. So Vats is Q. Emotes. Quick inventory is I. You'll, no, favorites, there it is, F. There we go. Yep, let's make it that 44. Nice, but we don't have that much ammo for it, whereas we do have a lot of ammo for this pipe pistol, so that's good. And how much are we carrying around? We're still carrying around a bit, aren't we? Mm. Uh, yeah. Let's eat some stuff. Improves energy damage. We don't want to do that. Let's just do that. Oh, we need some drinks. And maybe we should go back to our camp. I feel like that might be the, uh... Oop. Let's fast travel to our camp. Where we can do stuff. Yay!
We're on our way from misery to happiness today. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. All right. Now, where the hell did I put my camp? Is it just. Oh, there it is down there. It's weird that you, like, when you fast travel to someplace, it doesn't put you right there. It's odd. Alright. Store all junk. There we go. Um. Right. So we can store some of this random stuff here. Nope. Tab, cancel that one. Let's store in a bunch of food. For when we actually find a, a home and we start making an actual place. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Right, so we've got our stash. Claim the workshop. We're not going to claim the workshop. Attach soul's transmitter. Right. Yeah, let's fast travel for four caps. We now have hundreds of caps before we didn't even have 25, and it's because we've been questing, so that's good. Mobilized to help their fellow citizens. These responders became part government, part crisis relief. Of course. Why wouldn't they? I'm um, ready to rock. Yeah. Alright. So, we need to go... I think it's east. I think that's the right way. Yep, that's where we're headed. That's where we're going. This way. Oh. There seems to be a mountain in the way. That's right. We'll go, we'll go through town. That will be fine. That'll be no problem. Slocum Joe's. Large coffee and jelly donut. 30 bucks. Okay. Alright. I feel like we've been through here. So there shouldn't be things to discover, but let's go in here anyway, because it, it looks like there's a light on. There is a light on, but... Reverend Delbert Winters here, born and raised in this very town. Met my own church to the responders for their outpost here, and uh, you're welcome. The responders are on a true mission, you see. Helping folks through thick and thin, till the heavens open up again and take us all up anyways. When this all happened, I figured like most, it was time. At first, I thought it was a mistake that we were missed, forgotten, maybe we did some wrong. Didn't give enough to charity, maybe. Didn't praise his name, even in the worst. Maybe thought some things that ought not to have been thought. So I asked him. I asked how. Why? I fought your wars on Earth. I'm ready to fight them up there by your side. Then, in my despair, I saw some survivors eating raw rat carcass behind a dumpster. You ought to cook that first, I warned them. It seemed obvious. We tried but got sick, they said, covered in their own filth. I realized right then and there that I was being tasked. Then on, I built kitchens, cooked good food, fed anyone who walked up with an empty belly. And I was thankful for my task in life. Thankful. <laughs> Next time hell or high water land in my stoop, I'll be swept clear away with it. But until then, let's share a home-cooked meal together, all right? 
That's really nice. Oh, the skybox is really pretty. I will give it that. That is quite pretty. See, so, um, now that there's people in the game, the game is giving me good, like, Fallout 3 vibes and Fallout 4 vibes. Even though, on, if I'm being honest, Fallout 4 was not my favorite. My favorite Fallout game is definitely Fallout New Vegas. Probably followed by Fallout 2 and then Fallout 3 then Fallout 1, and then 4. Although this is... I like this better than 4, I think. 4 was okay. It just... They focused on, like, the grim dark aspect of it, and not, as, not enough on the funny parts. Yeah. So I don't know what Iron Ore does for us. I don't know if it does anything, so... But I didn't know you could mine it until we went to that mine. So I guess maybe that's part of the reason you go to that mine. Oop, there's a star. Don't know what the star is for, but... That's fine. I'm sure our little trusty pipe revolver here will uh, see us through. What's this? Uh, this is very surreal. What is going on here? I mean, we may as well, uh... Oops, we broke a bobby pin. Of course. Where did it go? I mean... So we got the- we got the rad roach. Nice. And it was just coming out to, uh... I don't understand, but that's okay. I don't know, I don't know what the, the point of this is, but we did unlock the gate. Unlock the door for whatever reason. I'm sure there was a good reason for it. What are we doing? Oh, we found another big city. Oh, there's some scorched. I got some atomic points. Those are valuable, I guess. Mm. So they were they were chilling. Oh. We do need some wood. I remember that from before. That wood was hard to come by for whatever reason. We're surrounded by forests, and, and wood seems to be reasonably plentiful, but... Here we go. Right. I mean, is this someone's base here? There are a lot of these little... things happening. A ballot printer. Alright, that's weird. So this is a voting station. Ah, I see. Weird. Very weird. Okay. Get some blood leaf. Go in the water. Start your training at Camp McClintlock. Who 
Who's this guy? I mean, is he a baddie or is he a goodie? I don't know. He didn't like immediately attack me. Oh. Okay, so he's a baddie. No way for me to know that. Yeah, so this is... Why did he have two pump-action shotguns? That seems just really weird. Alright, are more coming? Yeah, so there's at least one more. some baddies here for sure okay what the hell was just shooting at me Something with a laser rifle is shooting at me. Okay, I don't like that. Alright, let's go take that guy's laser rifle off him. Because that's obviously a problem. Come around and deal with this guy. Gotcha. That's what you get. Automatic laser rifle, though. That's very cool. What are we doing? Activate ballot measures. Oh, we get to vote. So we don't get to vote. Okay. That's cool. Alright, what else have we got going on? Mm. Ooh. So it's a lot of voting booths and stuff, so there's stuff happening here. Right. So what? Oh, I see. There's just a bunch of things. Start your training at Camp McClintlock. Well, we're not doing that. Um, find you boxes to bring the trend and... Bring the music back to summer school. Okay. Do we just get to... I mean, what do we... We found a... A jukebox. Why do we want... Bones? Okay. So I don't understand about the uh, fine jukebox of this thing, but that's okay. We're not meant to understand everything. Let's go into Duncan and Duncan Robotics anyway. See what's going on in there. Known as the forest, all right. Oh. 
Right. So we need a... We need an entrance card reader. Okay, let's go back out. So we gotta find something. We gotta find a thing that's an entrance card reader so that we can uh, get into this place. That makes sense. Totally makes sense. And it loads. This is quite a lot of loading. Sorry about that, team. Sometimes things load. There we go. All right, so. It's a mannequin. I was, uh, I was a little bit confused there. That's a good mannequin, for sure. Where are we going, though? Sometimes going up to see what's up high is, uh, is a worthwhile pursuit. For instance, it let us in here. Uh, yes. All right, yeah, I don't... I don't know, man. I don't know what we're, I don't know what we're meant to be doing here. I mean, we found the, uh, we found the roof access to everything, but, um, I don't have the, I don't have the card. So I'm really not sure. And I've killed all the, I killed all the dudes that were around. I thought, I think. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing now. Oh, we found a jukebox. I mean, I found the jukebox, right? So then, what am I supposed to do with it? Like... So shooting it does nothing? All right, well, I don't, I really don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. I'm starting to get a little bit worried that I don't know what I'm doing. Yep, so these are the guys I killed. Is there another way into this building? I, I guessing not. I'm guessing there's not. Um, find you boxes. Campaign hat. So we are finding some more stuff to loot that we must have walked past the first time. But, uh... We are not finding that card. And also the jukeboxes. I don't I don't really understand side. Um okay. Right, so we we just can't find the, the thing. So this is where we go. Let's go back in. We'll we'll go back in and we'll try it again. We'll see if I missed something because I I don't know at this point. Okay. Misk? Is it in Misk? 
Soul's transmitter. Yeah, Duncan and Duncan entrance card. Cannot equip this item. All right. Well, let's go back. Let's go back up and, and try it out. So these are all back again. So I'm guessing all the baddies are back as well. Yeah, all the baddies came back. I can hear something like out of the corner of my ear. There we go. I mean, I don't like having to fight these guys again, but I guess we get some stuff from them, so... That's handy. Oh, I'm supposed to turn the jukeboxes on because we're in Summersville. I was thinking I had to take the stuff away. That's me being stupid. That's fine. We're supposed to turn the music back on. All right. Will this work this time? Hey, it worked! Hooray! Finally. But it's really annoying that we had to restart the uh, the game. But that's okay. We eventually got there. Ooh, Mr. Handy Model. That's cool. We'll definitely have that. Let's talk oh. to Skinner. Well, now, what do we have here? Are uh, you another ghost? I am. I cannot bring you the peace you require, spirit. Leave me be. <laughs> um. Must we, spirit? Oh, so be it. Welcome to Duncan and Duncan's, Appalachia's premier robotics dealer. I am Skinner. How may I help you, alleged member of the living? <laughs> right. Assaultrons are military-grade hardware, my professed liveling. As such, all of our machines have already been spoken for. Outstanding deal with the United States military just waiting for pickup. You understand. I do understand. I'm sorry, but I simply cannot. The price of such a machine, even before its noted uptick in demand was in millions of dollars. Mm, right. Bottle caps? Actual trash? Hmm. Then it's likely safe to presume the amount you'd need to offer is in the mid-10 figures. Uh, yeah. Uh, not for purchase, no. The mid-condition Protectron and Handy bodies we have on the premises have been spoken for and our resupplier is already desperately late with our latest shipment i do hope you understand uh, i guess i do understand by all means right Is one protector on body to unlock access. Right. Lively. And can we go past him? Right. All right. So we need to purchase something. I mean, we haven't spent any stuff. I mean, if he's not going to say anything about us taking all this, I will definitely take all this. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a uh, nothing. All right. Hmm. 
Okay. There we go. So now we get the. Excuse me. Entrance into the showroom is for customers only. So is he about to fight me or? Okay. Well, I'm going in anyway. Oops. Oh, shoot. I see. I see. Right, so that's bad. I did a bad thing there. Nearly got it. Got it. All right. I like how Skinner is not saying anything here. Right, we better, we better heal up. I like that the security actually did something. Sometimes in these games, the security would do nothing. Investigate. You don't do nothing. Oh, we're way overloaded. Okay. Oh, that's the same. That's the same. Okay. Well, we're just going to pick our way through this place. It'll be awesome. Oop. I broke a bobby pin. That was not a good idea. Mm. Mr. Handy showroom key. Nice. We can load up on stuff. What is back here? We are going to have to get rid of some of this stuff before we leave, of course. Mm, yeah. Alright, so there's a Mr. Handy there, but... Uh, If we go through with it, then it will um, cause us some problems, I see. Read between the lines, James. I changed the code to the Assault Drone showroom. James, eight, you ha have to make your sale some other way. Eight, I've already given you the code, eight, so you don't need me, eight, but as you've shown, Tripsing around with these goons eight, you will never have eight read between the lines, James, I have. All right, so it's eight, 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 eight. Oh. Right, okay, so it's just the same thing over and over and over again. All right. No, we'll take it, we'll take it. What else? What else are we? What else are we doing in here? Take some military grade duct, duct tape, an extinguisher. Oh, um, oh, it's got a pin pad. There we go. We made it to the Assaultron room. Nice. Oh, whoops. I did not mean to do that. Oh, that is bad. Okay, that's bad. Let's... I, I accidentally backed up into it. So now we're going to be in a little bit of a fight here. Oh. 
Gotcha. All right. I did not. That was definitely a mistake. Oof, this is all bad. Now I'm just taking damage for no reason. Got it. Is there another one in here? There is. Okay. So we did well. I think. Pristine Assaultron body. Um, there we go. So I gave her the Assaultron body. That's good. We solved the, uh, solved the puzzle. We got a thing called Disease Cure, which seems a little bit, uh, nebulous. Oh. What is this back here? This is weird. This is a weird room back here. Oh, I see. We could have we could have come back here and attached it from behind without having to fight all these guys. I suppose that might have been a better idea. So what is back there? I mean, are we done now? We may as well turn on all the uh, jukeboxes, though, first. Expect the bill. <laughs> I would ask you to keep your hands off the merchandise. Ooh, there's iBots. I do like iBots. They're cool. Alright. So we made it. Let's go turn on all the jukeboxes now that we know what we're meant to be doing. That'll be very fun. Actually, I probably need to go to camp because I'm very loaded down. I'm just carrying around all sorts of crap from that showroom that I don't want to lose. So let's go do that. Yeah, man, the loading times are not great. It's the problem with it being online, right? Like if it was just a game. All right, well, let's turn on this jukebox now that I know what they, now that I know what they mean. They just mean to turn it on. So I can definitely do that. There's one, like, hiding in this cupboard over here. I remember it. Let's so we'll turn it on. And there's one more. Oh, I ran out of action points. I see. Scrap kit. What is a scrap kit? I don't, I don't know what any of that stuff is. Oh, so we, we use action points as we walk because we're, um, over, we're encumbered. That's cool, though. Is it up here? Is it over here somewhere? So we're inside the objective area. Let's just, we'll drink something, man. Give me some... There we go. And there it is. Hey, it was worth 50 caps. That's pretty good. Gotta like that. Our base is over here somewhere. There it is. It's actually not a bad spot for a base if you want to overlook a wasteland. It's pretty cool. Um, 10 millimeter pistol is bad, so let's scrap it. Um... Campaign hat's cool, but we'll scrap it anyway. 
Flare gun. Mr. Handy Fuel. Cool. Oh, no. Our machete is... We're still using that. Uh, all right. So let's store all junk. There we go. Nicely done. All right. So what do we need to do now? What's our... Return to the Wayward. But we could go start our training at Camp McClintlock. But we might we may as well finish off this quest because we're um, coming up on we're coming up on that delicious uh, two hours. Even though part of it was spent uh, trying to fix a bugged quest. Um, and yeah, two hours seems like a good amount of time to be streaming for. Uh, also, I've got other stuff that I want to be doing. And I have work tomorrow, so it's like a little bit after midnight right now. There we go. We will have completed the quest, which is the important thing. Alright. Hello. So, you gonna tell our girl about her new ride or what? You got one. Signals coming through loud and clear. You know, I don't throw the word hero around a lot. Come over here and let's discuss, huh? Uh, sure. <laughs> Your body's a jug of mute moonshine. You'll take what I got you. Now that's what I like to hear. Seriously, thank you for sticking your neck out for me. It's true. You've worked real hard putting things right for us. None of us are going to forget what you've done. But that really just leaves one last topic for us to discuss. Doesn't it? Crane, you ready to listen? Uh, I'm yeah. I'm just warning you, I can't guarantee you're going to be happy with what I'm about to say. Uh, sure. All right, then. Oh, we're following. So, I've known where Crane is. I know where his treasure is. But, well, there's a problem. What's the problem? What, he's dead or something? He's hiding in this bear rug. Where are we going? Honey, you awake? Oh. You want to give him a little nudge? Uh. How do we nudge him? Boy, 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 that thing's been up here the whole time? Over and over. That thing is Crane, Solomon. And what exactly would you have liked me to do with him? <laughs> Put it out of its misery. Those things are killers, Duchess. Look, Paulie and I have the scars to prove it. I don't recall this is super glitchy. To debate here. You agree with me, don't you? Uh, yeah. How could you not shoot that? Exactly. Okay, fine. But that person is fucking dangerous. And those things, they nearly killed Polly and I once. I can't let that happen to the rest of you. I promise. I'll do it with dignity. But I'm killing this thing if no one else is going to. What? Solomon, I wasn't even thinking of... You're right. Do it. Thank you, Duchess. I'll make it quick. 
unless you want to take care of it. Yeah, um... And who knows how long that'll take? We just wait around for this thing to get loose in the hopes that someone out there finds it? No. I'm sorry, but Crane's gone. The only decision to make here is are you doing it? Or am I? I mean, that sucks. Murder? No, you... You're right, I guess. Well, what about... We'll let him go. He's out of our hair and gets a fighting chance at a life. Who knows? Uh, maybe he'll last long enough for someone to find a cure. All right? Maybe he gets lucky. Be a nice change for you, wouldn't it, Mr. Crane? Fine. We'll let him go. Huh. I'll take care of the arrangements. Get him far. Far away from here. In the interim, honey, you're gonna need to reach into Crane's pocket there and grab a map and a key card. Just try not to get bit. Uh, sure. I mean, that, he's really creepy looking, for sure. According to that map, the treasure is in some kind of special cache tucked away inside Golly Mine. Sealed away behind a keycard locked door. Golly mine? That's where Polly and I tracked the scorched. Son of a... Does that... Did you lure those damn things here when you found the cache? You sure you still want to let him go? <laughs> Hush, Solomon. Now, this cache. I tried to check it out myself, but I didn't get real far. You're already intimately acquainted with Golly, so I suspect you've got the best shot at actually laying hands on whatever's in there. Fair so, enough. Here are my terms. I will let you keep said map and access card. No strings attached. As payment for everything you've done for us. But I need your word you'll come back and buy a drink every now and then. <laughs> and none of that cheap stuff I serve to the scrappers and Saul. Hey. I'm just realizing that having the right people in your life is more important than chasing riches. Um. Honey, I'll take it in tips. Now, is there anything else you want to discuss before heading out? Kinda. What boy is key? No idea, sweetheart. He was only ever here alone. And if he did have kids, well, they're long gone yeah I'll be fine this this is just the world we got now a lesson I keep seeming to forget lucky for me I just happen to have access to a variety of mind-altering substances so I'll bounce back but thank you for asking nice time to get wrecked um. maybe I have great vision Maybe he wore shirts with too many buttons undone. Maybe you don't need an answer to that question. You know what you needed. What say you let a lady maintain her air of mystery? Fair enough. Fair enough. Good luck. All right. You don't need to worry. I'm not going to hurt it. I mean, he was. He was going to hurt it. I mean, I think that's... Oh. Here we go. So, I think that's going to be us for today. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Um, follow me on Twitch, English Teacher Plays 42 uh, Subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is just English Teacher Plays. I play all sorts of games over there, indie games, and just basically anything. Uh, I try and do an upload every day, and I uh, hope you guys, I uh, hope I'll see you guys on the next stream. Class dismissed!